gun range today AK-47s hopefully we'll be able to record we'll see what happens so this is what we're shooting today plus an AK-47 as well No, dobra, stajemy obok siebie. Ok. Index finger, side up. Ok. Jak go można cofnąć, bo nie jest. Nie, sam... on nie jest ukarany, sam się zrobi. Sam, sam się ustawi. Tak. Cofnie też do tyłu. A zobacz. So, we've just completed our shots. Mark, because I'm not very good with guns. Uh, what guns did we shoot? Oh, um, most of them are like civilian. Civilian versions of military weapons. The M16A2, I think, was about the closest. Um, there was a, like a 308, like dragging off style thing, but it was a, a, a civilian version. Um, a HK, which was the same as like a, um, a G36, but like a civilian version type of thing. That was pretty cool. Um, their little, I, I don't know what the, the Polish thing was. One, one of the Polish things was a 556 uh, AK style thing, like, but built in Poland, that was pretty cool. And the little uh, 9mm like, Polish version of an Uzi, that was kind of, that was pretty tricky as well. Yeah. <laughs> I, I like the M16, the M16 had such a cool recoil. That was about the best, that was about the best I did, like um, with the M16 at 25 meters handheld, which is probably pretty crap. <laughs> but anyway. I think I had a, had a pretty good run as well. Mine was, uh, Let's just say the guy. The guy's not having a good day. Yeah. It, and that that little guy. Don't yeah. worry about that little guy. <laughs> <laughs> the interesting thing is that the gun range in Australia, you're not allowed to have a target that looks like a human. But that's the problem. <laughs> Even the guy told us he's he's looking at this guy. He's just going, look at this mofo. He's pointing a gun at you. So uh, you got to take him out. And the guy was shooting tobacco up his nose before he even began the safety presentation. So this has been a very, very cool trip. Uh, not too expensive either. I mean, we've shot six rifles at ten rounds five on rounds four of them, and then five rounds on no three round ten no ten on most of them, and five rounds on, <coughs> on two five rounds on two. Yeah. And that was like a dollar a dollar fifty each. So I think we spent close to 60, 70 bucks for, for this trip, so it was really, really worth it. You got a stern gear here, like yeah. that was a replica. I thought that was really cool. that's, that's, that's German, that's like the original assault rifle, like the original of the originals, the M16s, the AKs, all that, that is the original one. Shoot before they break. And this is how Mark and me get thrown out before we even do anything else. <laughs> Hello, how are you? Yeah. So we yeah. just finished. That was absolutely fantastic. <laughs> Done a bit really of shopping cool. as well. What do you think, boys? How was it? What is love, What is love, Why am I zooming in? <laughs> Whoa, what was that? <laughs> that was absolutely fantastic.
<laughs> We're going to miss having Polish ice cream. Best Polish ice cream ever. But who was it? Mum. It's really good. No, no, it's, like, it's not like the that Mr. Mama, Whippy Mama. stuff we get in no. Australia it melts real quick. And this yeah. doesn't. Yeah, it's good stuff. Yeah. Yeah. That's mine. In my head, and I know they're just fragments of a world where your absence all I get to see. Well, we are done in Dinsk. Just at the end here, managed to get a couple of drone shots in a safe area. It's been a great, great trip, but a bit of rain, a little bit of gun shooting, ate a lot of food. <laughs> yeah. more vodka. We'll need more detox yeah. when we get back. Prunes and lemon juice, that's it. Yeah.